super super popular <clears throat> body style more in the rat rod industry than anything you know and um so let's uh let's do one that's kind of tweaked and and you know bent out of shape but finished and you know and pick on the things that you know let's not just decorate a cake here let's let's fix the things on these cars that are the worst you know and you know whether that's seating position or you know ride quality or whatever so we really concentrated on the suspension stuff you know on making one of those cars actually drive good and ride good where you want to get in it and go drive it you know and i mean yeah it'll get you from point a to point z but i mean it really you know that thing it, the, the ride quality is amazing with the torsion bars that we did so everything so fabricated you know, the there everything fabricated there in house yeah, everything, the everything's done here yep yep everything's done here it's all one off and uh, you know hitting torsion bars and then the way we did the steering on the cowl, you know, yeah, it looks cool, but it's for a reason. You know, it's that bump steer, and, and then obviously those cars, there's never enough room for your feet inside. So by moving this, the gearbox up, you know, now we've created space for the pedals. And, you know, and then by dropping it back down on the cowl and getting that lower pivot point down on the, um, you know, tie rod or the, uh, the pivot arm being low and everything, the drag links all running in the same mark, you know, blah, blah, blah. It just eliminates the bump steer. You know, there's such a limited amount of space there to get something to sit right and everything. You know, it'd be, um, you know what order to, you know, how, what order the radiator goes in and um, where the axle can be and where the torsion bars can be. And uh, that was a pretty, pretty tricky, a lot, a lot of thought went into the front of that, you know, to get everything. And now, obviously, when it's done, it just looks like, to me, it looks normal, it looks simple, you know, and that's, that was the idea of it. But it was a lot of, a lot of packaging and stuff like the radiator. Uh, we machine the tanks here. I buy the cores and then we machine the tanks and I weld them together. But like the uh, the upper upper water necks, you know, big O-ring that screws on because the, the uh, radiator drops out the bottom of the car. Mm -hmm. You know, it drops straight down. That's the only way it can come out. So um, just things like that, you know, because we're definitely into function 100%. So got to be able to work on it, you know, fairly easy sure. and stuff's got to be able to come apart, you know. So um, while we're while we're building that stuff, you know, that's the one thing we're good at. You know, mm -hmm. in the past, obviously, you trapped yourself a lot, but we're getting 